is SMX31. Think about the future. It won't take long before oceans are under permanent surveillance and navies will have to perform in very intricate environments where civilian and military activities will be completely nested. The submarine will have to be even more stealthy, autonomous and better informed. They will need appropriate means of action to, be, to make sure they can operate freely, gather and share intelligence and act firmly if necessary. That's what we show with SMX-31. It's uh, stealth, endurance and invulnerability at the paramount. Let me give you a few examples. Energy. What if your submarine could stay hidden underwater for months? Today it's an asset of nuclear submarines, but tomorrow SMX-31 will do it for you, thanks to a huge energy capacity and a solid smart energy management system. In addition, stealth. Stealth will make her very undetectable. Look at the shape. It's inspired by biomimicry, but also designed against active acoustic means. Your crew will have to conduct very complex missions, and that's why in your control room, with only 15 people on board, you only have 15 people on board. In your control room, artificial intelligence will bring the right level of information to your tactical situation. SMX-31 is a smart ship, but not, not only. It's also part of a smart naval force. And that's why connectivity is very important. The use of drones, for example, for connectivity shows it. SMX-31 can act as a submerged control station, an advanced station. So if I conclude, it would be to say that today, Naval Group invests to prepare the future on technologies, for example, such as energy, batteries, and so on, stealth with the materials, with the technologies, connectivity, drones, weapons, and so on. It's something we do today to prepare further and further with the help of the French state.